Columbia School, but certainly to, uh, to our program, the International Baccalaureate Middle Years Program and the Diploma Program. And in one of the videos, they spoke about this IB learner profile where we're trying to build students with the capacity to be principled, well-rounded, risk takers, and reflective. And there are 10 other things, but I don't want to mention them all. But the one I want us to focus on is reflection. Because as we move forward and take our journey, as I said earlier, we're not a perfect school, but we're pushing our students into a direction that we feel strongly, the staff, and our, my hope is that the parents too, that this is critical for your child's success. To engage in this program, to engage in the work, even when it hurts, even when it seems complicated, even when it seems like a lot of work. Because we know the bottom line is life is not easy. So, you know, um, and you know, there have been tons of songs written about it, no pain, no gain, you know, um, I mean, I could think of more, but I'm not gonna do that. But, I mean, even as a culture, we understand, you know, that it does take blood, sweat, and tears, and not necessarily the blood, but it does take the focus of being, of understanding that it is hard work and that you have to be well disciplined. And sometimes our students live for the moment and they feel that these are the best years. But my hope is for them is that they sacrifice now so they really can enjoy the best years ahead. And so with that, I want you to think, because I want to hear from you families that have been here today and your reflection on the work of the staff and the community members and the transition committee for some reflective comments before we close today and I do some uh, door prizes. And you have to stay with these door prizes. <laughs> yes. Can you speak up so we can hear you? You want to come up to the mic or are you going to use a teacher voice? Very good, very good. Good question. Uh, right now, I don't want to respond to that because we're on the guidelines of the school district and when they allow us back in the building. We will have some level of back to school event and we hope that that can be sometime before the year actually starts and we hope it will be. But the actual date we cannot give you at this time because as you know, our district is in transition and although we're moving, you know, we have Langley closing, we have Oliver closing, we have Northview closing, and so we have a lot of transition going on in the district. So right now, they're not giving us a date of when that will be available, but when it will be, I will be sure to communicate it via our website, mailing, um, alert now, which is our phone notification system, et cetera. Yes, sir. I'd just like to say that this program today has been everything I anticipated being and more, and it really challenges me as a parent of a future sixth grader to even get my act together as far as the discipline. <laughs> to ensure that his success at Obama will be real. So I just want to thank everyone that was responsible for today for it really means a lot. I'm a little bit concerned in honesty about uh, transportation, but we'll work all that out in safety. But thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Ms. Roster, one of our departing parents. Now you can definitely 